It's always a challenge to go through hundreds of talented high school athletes and narrow them down to one player of the year. We looked at some record-setting All-Americans from Florida to California to Michigan. But we went with the best player on arguably the country's best team. Quarterback Tate Martell led powerful Bishop Gorman High School to perhaps its best season ever. He led the Gales to wins over elite programs from Texas, Hawaii, Florida, and California. And he put up some impressive numbers along the way. He threw for 2,300 yards and 41 touchdowns while rushing for another 1,200 yards and 21 more touchdowns. Something to keep in mind when looking at those numbers? He often rested in the second half of in-state games. Bishop Gorman defeated Nevada opponents by an average of 55 points per game. The winning culture at Gorman drew Martell in three years ago, and he's been impressed with it ever since. I came here my sophomore year, so I mean, I, I kind of had a little bit, I had some of the guys like Nico Fertitta, Alizé, and Cordell, and guys like that, that kind of helped me, bring me along as a sophomore. So when I came, it wasn't easy, because I was already kind of behind the curve when I came. Um, but I mean, playing here, you, you develop like a, uh, a trait of like toughness and stuff like that. I mean, you just, you have a will that you, you'll never stop until you win the game. I mean, that's kind of just what I've... I became here. I mean, I just I became a winner. Definitely coming here. I mean, you, that's all you. That's all you want. It doesn't matter about anything else except for winning the games. Tate won Nevada's Gatorade Player of the Year as a sophomore, and again this year as a senior. His teammate Biagio Ali Walsh won it last season, and the two have been quite a one-two punch. It helps. It makes us look like really good coaches when you got good players. You know what I mean? So yeah, when you got guys like Biagio and Tate. Um, back there and you guys running the football and, and take and run or pass I mean as, as a defensive coach those are hard to, to, to account for I think that I can manage the game really well and then when plays break down that that's when I when I come to my best Tate has always had his doubters when it comes to his potential as a college quarterback as he doesn't have ideal size at five feet ten inches tall but that's really the only negative thing anyone can say about Tate he's become one of the top prospects in his class and he never lost a game in a Gorman uniform. I mean, everybody's always said, I mean, that, okay, you're short, you can't do this and that, but every single year I prove them wrong. I mean, if you can't beat me on the field, then what, what is it going to do if you're 6'5"? There's a ton of good quarterbacks that I've seen that are shorter guys that can go out there and just flat out ball. I mean, Kyler Murray was a good dude that can just go out there and just straight up just own the game single-handedly. And then look at Russell Wilson, what he's doing in the NFL. I mean, his first couple years he went to a couple uh, NFC championships, won a Super Bowl, like all that. Tate is committed to Ohio State for next season. After previously being committed to Washington and to Texas A&M, Tate was happy to get an offer from the coaching staff he felt most comfortable with. Ultimately, I felt like Ohio State was the best school for me because um, that's been my dream school since real young, and they, they offered me kind of late, but I mean that's just where I wanted to go. For his leadership and all the winning he's done at Bishop Gorman, Tate Martell is our National High School Football Player of the Year.